Hello and welcome back to City Skylines 2 and the city, now the big city apparently, of Knightsbridge. Thank you very much for joining me in today's video. Last time out, this was what I was working on uh, predominantly, which was this roundabout and the bypass that you can see that is supposed to go skirting around the edge of the current city centre. Now having played this for a while, or letting this run for a while, I found that this is not quite doing the trick because traffic in City Skylines 2 is just chaotic. Um, I have learnt that there is a, a mod, or there is a way to put a mod on. Not quite traffic precedent, but it does improve all of this, so I might be looking, might be looking at how to do that and seeing what I can do with that in the future, but for now this is what I have to deal with. In today's video I'm not going to be focusing on this whatsoever, in fact I am going to be indirectly, I think, indirectly fixing some of these issues, but the way I'm going to be doing it is by doing some extremely extensive work on the motorway network, or the highway network, or the interstate network, whatever you want to call it. So make sure you stay tuned, because there is going to be a lot changing on the motorway and trunk roads, so sort of major roads that go around the city. There are going to be some major changes on that, which should help traffic flow within the city, theoretically. But knowing City Skylines too, it may not work. There's only one way to find out. Let's get started. And as Nigel Phelps is complaining, cannot seem to get anywhere without well, a traffic jam. That is what we're going to be fixing. So, of course, there are a number of issues that we have and one of them is caused by all the traffic coming in and out of the city so we've got any traffic wanting to come into the city has to go through this slip road and then up to this roundabout and then feed in wherever they want and any traffic coming out has to also come all the way around here and then down this way subsequently we also have the same sort of issue here down what is apparently called middle street okay no idea but this this highway apparently is the only way out of the city to the to the north which is which is no good uh, felicia noble is having a plenty of free time which is great and so i want to try and fix this because at, at the very least it will give us less traffic for anybody wanting to go here and then through the town out here. Now there may be, there may not be that many people doing that, but going forward there will be. Also, I want to do something over here with, with this section here, so that anybody who wants to just go directly to this side can do so. We also need a bridge from here across here for the entire motorway network so to start with as a shall we say a test of sorts i'm going to just pop a small road from here uh, curved oh yes of course i have to do this to it i do not want that elevation step though can you do this without the massive elevation step? Yes, apparently we can. If I do that. And join that onto that. There we go. Well, how does that work? Because that is... That is clearly an elevation step. Um, okay. Some 
times I just do not understand how this works. I'm going to have to figure this this one out at some point. But this is sort of okay-ish. Cannot wait for mods to start. And that might help ease up some of the congestion. The next thing... Oh, and I can add traffic lights here. Oh, traffic lights are already here. That is fine. Good. Do I need traffic lights here? I'll leave them there for now and we'll see if... There we go. Traffic does indeed begin to use this particular road. I think traffic lights are not necessary at this juncture, so... Goodbye? There we go. Goodbye. That was strange. Right. How much money am I making? Four million. Five million. Okay. Great. That is going to be um, pretty good for what I want to do here. So, the this M1 motorway. The first thing... Uh, let me think. Okay, you know what? The first thing I want to do is create a junction here. Yes, this is the first place that I would like to create a junction. And this junction will have to go underneath and then pop out here. How am I going to do this? So, I have ideas. I know how I want to do things, but I do not know how this will work in city skylines. So, never mind. I'll ignore that bit. Let's start with a junction here. Do I want this to be into the ground or not? That is that is a question. So, slow that down. Because what I could do is I could cut this in the ground a little and then create a roundabout up here that then just works. I think I'm going to do that. So, um, how, how am I going to do this? Ah, yes, this is what I'm going to do. Temporarily, I will build a, so this is where I'm going to have the junction. Is this a good place for a junction? Oh, come on. I think it should be. Or could I do the junction here? No. Do the junction here because that will allow me to at least get all of this area. Yes, so if I do the junction there and have a main road, which will probably head out in that direction which means I'm going to have to start unlocking some of these things. Okay, so just to get this all out of my way, and this is all going to go up to... Can I build out of my... No, exceed city limits. Just get this completely out of my way for now. Um, yeah, out here. Out here. Just well away from anywhere that I'm going to be doing my work and then back onto that there we go and then I can get rid of this road did that just rename everything to the Sycamore Highway why this is the M1 I don't know. Why have you done that? This is the M1. Let's, let's call this M1 Westbound. Because that is what it is. And then, what I will do, is I'll do the same thing, but from here. Like this. So I'll just bung this right along there. In fact, it could probably stay fairly close. 
doesn't really matter because maybe if I redo all of this, I'll do it. In fact, I think I will. When I remake the motorway, I'm going to make it much, much closer. M1, eastbound. There we go. And apparently now it's wants to re rename that the M1. I'm not even going to ask. So we have a really, really messy motorway here, but for now, that works. The next thing I need to do is I need to break this section or I need to figure out how deep I want to cut this section in because the roundabout is going to sit on top of it so we're going to have to use some landscaping we'll make the brush fairly small so that I know what I'm doing and let's try and level it to Let's find out what sort of levels we have here. So I can see where the motorway went, which was there. And that, there's a light uphill gradient. So if I level this, that is going to stay level. If I shift this, that's a bit, bit much, isn't it? There we go. Let's increase that strength so it's very strong. Okay. Is that going to let me do what I wanted to do? No. I want to drop that just... Why does it... Okay. Well, not quite that low. Maybe there. How does that look? That's perhaps a little lower than I would want. There we go. That is a good height. Good. Now. So the first thing I want to do is pop the motorway into this, into this pit. Make that bigger now. Pop the motorway into this pit. Which, surprisingly, from here is not that bad. And that was part of the plan, was to try and make it so that in this section it isn't too, too bad. Then go up here. Keep the motorway fairly low. And there. So that is where the motorway is now going to going to be. So I'll go ahead and do that. Next, what I want to do. So that, that is the new cutting for the motorway. Good. Next up, I think what I will do is make the roundabout first. So I need this bit flattened for the roundabout perhaps do the same thing on this side so I'll flatten up this whole bit in fact if I copy that there we go that gives me an idea as to where the roundabout will go roughly so it's going to be a fairly large roundabout uh, you know like those kind of sizes and then I can just cut that back and that will allow me to put the bridge in for the motorway. Good. Let's have a look at what the motorway can give us. So three lane, this is a three lane highway to have a peak. So if it comes in through here, we'll have it run. Let's see. Can I parallel these? I can. Um, That is so much better. And just, you know what, just switch all zoning off. Just, just let me run this the way I want to run it. 
Although over here I need it to be where the, where the roundabout is going to be, just there. I'm going to need it to be fairly straight, I would say. So I'll do that. Uh, right. Hang on. Let's do the roundabout bits first. So that is perfectly straight. There we go. Like that. And then all I need to do is grab this and hook that onto that. Okay. That is the new motorway cutting. It doesn't look too shabby, to be to be honest. That seems to look okay. Actually, that looks fairly all right. I'm sure I can... Uh, let's see. I can smooth this out afterwards, but as a as a motorway cutting, that that is not too bad. I could even go ahead and try and find a way to make a screenshot of this. Say make a screenshot, sort of take a screenshot of this. So this is showing where the motorway is going to be going going forward. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Next up, I need one of those roundabouts. Small road, um, three lane, one way road. That could be what I want. Do I want a three lane roundabout or a four lane roundabout? I think a three lane roundabout should do the trick. Should definitely do the trick. Oh, and it looks like I'm running low on battery once again on my laptop. I shall fix that completely with my squeaky chair. As to why I have a squeaky chair, who knows. Feeling sick after drinking water, what? Do we have water problems? Not that... I can see. Hmm. Okay. Also, I have so many things to unlock, but that can go a little later. Right. This is where the roundabout is going, so... Let's try and do the whole parallel thing, but... Spread it out quite far. Apparently 12 is the maximum. Uh, will that do? You know what, I think... I think that 12 will will be possible. I think running 12 will, will, will actually work. So if I... No, I could even do 11. Oh, it just had to go dark right now. Shame! So... I cannot remember whether it was a mod or not, but in City Skylines 1, when it was dark and you were building things, it put a spotlight up for you. And it was really, really useful. There we go. That is that. Can I have this one with no parking or no sidewalks or something. Can I do that? Is it sidewalks? Lighting. Sound sound barriers. Hmm. That could be interesting. No, apparently there's no there's no option to get rid of the pavement. Great. And then what I need to do is take this one and in the dark, you know what, let's try and fast forward this so that maybe the light comes back. Uh, switch that off. We're doing just a basic curve. Oh, of 
course, this is not going to work, is it? Right, um... What, what are you going to be able to give me? Switch off all snapping wool. Really? You will not allow me to do that? That is a perfectly valid... That, to me, is a perfectly valid shape. Right, okay. Okay. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to bulldoze this bit, bulldoze this bit. There and there. There and there. I'm then going to put the motorway in with its very tiny gap, but I am going to get rid of that. I'm going to increase the gap just in this area to to that. Okay. Good. Then switch the parallel road off and just connect so grab this one and just connect it up like that. Grab this one and connect it up. Switch all of this off actually. Connect it like that. This is terrible. This is really, really terrible. And look at this. What on earth is going on here? And I'll do the same on this side. I suppose... Similarly here... Well, that could just potentially work in that straight fa oh go on come on there we go that looks atrocious right i'm going to have to fix that somehow that is going to have to be fixed because i'm not i'm not having that right back to where we were so you start at zero pick this now We'll do 40 metres, and then, obviously... See, if it was able to understand this, I would do that. But it cannot. It just cannot understand that I want to go across there. So I have to... No, 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 no. You are not overlapping this time. That's apparently 4.2, so I'm going to... I'm going to actually flatten this. What is this two point three zero point five I think that is going to have to do so we'll go eighty eight degrees now ninety degrees forty nine meters sure and then just stop stop with everything uh do that no 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 you you are not doing that you're doing this connect up to that okay at least that bit has worked how do i turn this around how do I turn this road around? No, how do I... How do I turn this road around? Well, I'm going to have to figure out how to turn that road around, but we now have part of a roundabout. Now I've got to make the rest of the roundabout and also just mess... This, this is all a bit messed up, so... Going to just fix this. There you go. I don't know what that that has done. 
I have no idea what that bit there is. I'm slightly concerned. Okay, you. From here. How do I... How do I turn you around? Is there a way to do that? What, what if I... Tried... No, street lights. Street... No. No street lights. Trees? No. Traffic lights? No. Underground mode? No, no, no. If I cannot turn this around, this is a complete waste. And also, I know that there have been some people saying, well, oh, City Skylines 2 is fine. Um, you know, it's just the way you play it. No, no, it really is not. If this, if this is the kind of problems that you have, then y this is not fine. No, that's not right. Oh yes, I have to switch all of that off. Well, not all of... Which one do I have to switch off? Snap to building. Snap to existing geometry. That is probably what I have to switch off. Maybe. Snap to zone grid. No. Snap to angles. I mean, that is right, but... Ah, that's probably the one. There we go. That will work. Uh, 0.4. Sure. Uh, just... It, it will have to do. There must be a way to turn this around the opposite way. There has to be. Surely. What do you mean overlapping items? There are no overlapping items here. It only overlaps because of the incompetence of... What? Come on, just, just join this up properly. No... No, not quite. There we go. That is better. There. Now. No. No. No, no, no. Can I... Right, can I somehow... Somehow manage to grab this. Turn it in here and just let it... No, because that is just not the right angle, is it? None of that is the right angle. That just completely ruins the... the roundabout. Um... okay. I fail to see why this is such a difficult thing to do. There, there we go. Okay, now the roundabout is done, but we have the problem with the with the incorrect angles, or the incorrect driving sides of the road. I have no idea how to fix that, but I'm going to leave it for a moment whilst I try and fix the bigger mess that is this. Um, how am I going to do this now? The way... I'm going to do this, is I'm going to level this. Why are you suddenly... There we go. Plenty of leveling. Then I'm going to put the motorway back in. With its parallel bit. Nice and close. But the way I'm going to do it is that I'm going to try and measure how this would pan out. So maybe if I do that. There. Okay. Now what I should be able to do is I should be able to switch off the parallel bit and do this sort of curve. which will look better on that side and subsequently better on this side than previously. That does look better and I think 
I can do the same sort of thing here. So, right. You just, just break that. I'll, I'll figure that, so I'll figure that bit out. I'm just waiting for the sun to come up now. Which it should be, looking at the shadows. And of course, I have to be doing this in winter, because why would I do it in at any other time of the year? You know, summer, where it would be much easier and, and less work. There we go. That will do. Now, motorway. Again, put that in. Figure this one out without those. Say from there, there. Okay, and then back to single, and just just figure this out with one of those complex curve thingies. That, and then this one should be fairly easy to open up. No, not quite. Why are you so complicated? Is it because this is on a turn? I think it's because this is on a turn. Right. Um, cut this bit, please. There we go. And then give me... Oh, winter's over apparently already. And very gentle. I think that might have to do. When is when is the sun going to come up in this in this title? Okay, that is good. I just have to figure this out now. Just just get these these bits working. And to think this is just one motorway that I'm working on also. Um, three lane, you know what, let me start upgrading some of these overlapping items. What's overlapping? Are you serious? You, you are, you are serious. So if I just try and budge you along, distance too short. What are you overlapping with? How is this? Right, okay. For now, you're going to three lanes all the way across here. I hope this works. So, I could maybe... Upgrade and then downgrade, potentially. That is not that is not valid. This here is not valid. Just just please don't get rid of that snapping. There must be a way. I have to be missing something. I have to be missing something here. I mean, distance is too short. Oh. I can move this along. Here we go. Just enough. Excellent. And then this one just is complaining about all sorts of stuff. Why is that distance too short? I, I'm failing to understand what the issue is here. I'm really failing to understand the issue. In any case, bring this all up to three lanes. Apparently that was a thing. Why is that a thing? I have no idea. And then distance too long. Okay. I, I have n no clue. 
what is going on there. And I suppose I'm going to have to three lane all of this. Because this, this part of the motorway is staying as far as I know. Not decided that it is disappearing. Up to up to there. Yeah, up to there. And then it's just going to go dip down. Which is it is not that much of a dip down, so I'm not I'm not too concerned about that. I do wonder what 2024 is going to bring for City Skylines 2 because again, I'll say it and um, maybe I think a lot of people have probably said it. This, this title was not ready to release. What, why they released it, uh, I do not know. So that is all of this now three lane. That, see the way that currently is, I, I would, I would want that to be Yes, like that. That is what I want. But we'll sort this. This whole junction is going to change anyway, so I'm not going to worry about that just yet. Um, how's the traf traffic problems? Great. How have I managed to move the traffic problems from... What have I done that has caused this now? People are cutting out... I suppose these two are technically the wrong side. You'd want the bypass coming this way. But then people would just start going in there and causing all that, all that traffic, all the mess over there. I have no idea. I have no idea how to run this. I should have paused that. I think this is also a good time to end this video because, well, this is literally all I've managed to do. That, even that looks really, really bad. Can I, can I see what happens if I attempt to upgrade? If I upgrade this, I can move it just that little bit. Maybe that will help a bit no wait i can change the direction of these right no no hold on there must be a way to change the direction of this upgrade upgrade look no yes there it is no what no there we go that is what I was trying to do, so it's click and drag. And what, why? What is that? Come on, switch that off. No, no, no. There we go. I'd eventually figure it out, and this, I guess, this also gives me a bit of a fine tuning options. And then, what do we have? This bit, this bit's here. Right, that is that done. I guess I have to give this some more stuff, like... Can I put no parking on these? There has to be a... There has to be something. Because these are really fast. And this, this should not be fast. Well, I guess it could be. But it should not be. What I want is... Something that does not support parking. There are no options for that. Okay, next up, I'm going to keep going just for a little bit. Especially here. I think what we should do is have a slip road. slip road from 
Let's see, how far away are we looking? From there? Up to there. Pretty much the kind of slip road I want. And the slip road will pop on to the roundabout like that. Um, so you'll, you'll come off the motorway, up the hill we go. Okay, I'll have to, I'm going to have to improve that a little. Um, how am I going to improve that? What is that? Oh, that is because of the... Never mind. I know what that is. I, I can deal with this. There we go. Well, that was... That is not... That is not the junction I, I just made. How is that the junction? That is the junction. So why are you not keen on... Okay, well, apparently that is what you want, and then... I guess eventually that, yeah, that will have to become a two... That slip road will end up being two ways. Where are the lights on this thing as well? Oh, it is not connect... Well, apparently the traffic lights are working. It's not connected to the network, is it? No, no, none of these have lights. Why do you not have lighting? Is that what this is for? Yes. Light up the motorways. Just, just light it all up. There we go. Okay. Um, do that, do that, have a road out there, road out there, so what I will do is, just as a bit of a preparation here, um, six lanes, do I want six? Probably, just for a little bit here. Yes, that, that is exactly what I want, actually. Coupled with three lanes that will peel off from... Three lanes from where? Why are you overlapping? What? Right. Three lanes from here. Or let's say from here to... Here? Okay, hang on. Three lanes from here to... That's it. That is better. Sort of. I'm going to have to figure that one out in a little bit. And then three lanes from here to... Maybe... We should do it like that. Nope, same same problem. Same Same issue. That is what I want, though. Um, let's try this again. A little bit better. And then, what was it again? I just drag to change direction. There we go. That does work. Um, this could be moved a little. There. No. There. There we go. That is better. That is... That is exactly how I want that. So that is good. This bit can be moved in a little... No. no. Come on. That's a little bit better. Although on this side it's a mess now. I'll have to redo that one. 
but we are getting somewhere. And then, if I just grab the six lane road, which was that one, and just say, let's just, let's just go out on a journey here. Let's just do that, and just so that I can have all of this lit up temporarily, I will put a silly little gravel road. Can the gravel road carry electricity? It can. From here to there. That should light up. There we go. Now the entire motorway is lighting up. Um, give me electricity. That part I do think is quite cool. I, I do think that bit of it is... is a very nice aspect to to city skylines too. Uh, so some things they you know they they do get some things correct. Maybe from here up to what do you mean slope too steep? Come on, you can do this. There we go. That would. And then they go ahead and do that. Right. How is that a... How is that... A reasonable... I have no idea, but... I think that this is... Oh no, what is going on here? Not enough electricity. Electricity bottleneck. What? Electricity bottleneck, what, what? Okay. So we have a bottleneck there. Why is the electricity not... Oh, it's all trying to flow... Okay. I have a solution. I have a solution for this that will be cheap and very easy. I'll just switch. There we go. Uh, solution found. Why did this not warn me of this? This this problem. There we go. Everybody okay with electricity again? Good. Because now we have the electricity going in that direction and that direction. So we have plenty to go around. That that is cool. Electricity bottleneck. That is that is rather cool. So there are some things, as I said, there are things that City Skylines 2 does well. This is still going to bottleneck, isn't it? Why are you still going to bottleneck? Why can you not just start pumping more this way across through here? In fact, just... just I would much rather you start pumping it... Oh, it is. Stop pumping it across this bridge. Yes, that that will that will help. Okay, good. Um, what was I going to do? I was going to end this video. That is what I was going to do. After being disappointed with that. But why would you? Why does that look like this water there? Is it just me or is there water? There. There's water. We're not at water level or we're not at sea level. We may be really close to sea level. Right. That could be a problem. Let me try this again. I do really want these things to work, so... Uh, from here. How does that look? Please tell me that's smooth. No. No, it is not. Um, okay. How, how am I going to smooth this one? Is there a way to smooth it? Maybe using the smooth tool. Maybe if I try and do soften terrain just here. 
maybe that will help a little. Soften that terrain. No, that is just that has just made it worse. Really? Look, how how will you manage that now? No, that has that has improved it somehow. No idea how, but it has. Uh, let's add some lighting on this particular road too. Not traffic lights. Yep, those. Why did it require... Okay, that's fine. Well, at least I can sort of see now as to where I'm going. So that is the new... The new motorway area. Um, it, it is problematic to say the least. That should not have taken me as long as it has, but that is just part one. This is probably going to be so. In the next part, in the next video, I'm going to try and finish off these slip roads and maybe build something to connect it out here. In fact, you know what? Let's have a look at what we can and cannot unlock. Um, Fernlock one, two. I can unlock 21 tiles, three. And let's say I wanted to do something out here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. That. That's 10. Say it went, say I was trying to make a road and the road goes up here. That way, you know, get rid of that one. That will unlock that entire section. That's 15. In fact, I may as well unlock some of the other bits around here that I might want to do as well. I guess the road could be way up here. Oh, that is not going to be enough. Unless the junction ends up over here, which is probably the better option. Meaning that is not needed. The road will go here. And then out there. Perhaps I need to do something like that. Yes. There we go. That's a that's another set built. How far do I need to go to get to the next one? Um, 7,000 of 36,000. Okay, it is going to take a while. It is certainly going to take a, take a while, but I'm making ridiculous amounts of money for some reason. For not much. I mean, look here. Take that down to 10%. Take that down to 11%. Take that down to 15%. Take that down to 12%. How will that have an impact on the money I'm making? Still crazy amounts. And people will probably be even happier. Um, oh yes, there was something about city services that I found. City policies, there we go. Uh, not high speed. Highways. It Industrial filters reduce air pollution and ground pollution in industrial zones, produce more garbage. Well, I just want to see some of these before I end, because what? what's our storage like? 213 out of what? Right, we're doing 150 tonnes a month. So what does that mean? What does that mean at the moment? Are you collecting 213 out of 150 tons per month, which means that slowly this thing will increase, or or what? And then we have a recycling centre, which is doing that. So that is still happening as well. Okay, I'm, I'm going to have to figure some of that out. Anyway... Now that daylight has arrived, let's go ahead and unlock a few things before before um, 
calling it an episode one hour later let's unlock the advanced pumping station let's unlock the health research we'll get to that in a minute ground pollution that could be an interesting one let's grab the incinerator let's take a technical and medical university let's take I don't really need much of these do I firefighting helicopter no not really a bank a bank could be, oh we only have nine to play with yes yes this this is what I'm going to do both of those will get to an airport at some point as well now I have three and there's nothing I can do with three okay that is that is good I'm going to end this video here thank you very much for watching this particular mess what I might do is I might just connect this up before the next video and see hopefully it, it works if not I have no idea what I'm going to do but thank you very much for watching please remember to click on the like button if you like this video subscribe to the channel for more videos on wait will that go over it might subscribe to the channel for more videos on city skylines too what are you lot complaining about high rent okay uh, leave a comment in the comments box below letting me know what you think if you know of any mods that allow me to change the height of roads to work with traffic lights and all of that kind of stuff please do let me know i could really really do with those because this is just chaotic it's look at this this is just absolutely chaotic um if you can do so please do consider supporting me on patreon so i fixed the inbound and now i've got problems outbound great if you can do so, as I said, please do consider supporting me on Patreon, link in the description box below, as are links to my social media and Discord server. That is all from me, and I shall see you next time in City Skylines 2, where, oh, there's been an accident. I will continue with this motorway junction, get it done, and then move on to the main one.